हरे कृष्णा मोर इम्पॉर्टेंट देन अंडरस्टैंडिंग वॉट वी ऑब्जर्व इज अंडरस्टैंडिंग वॉट इट इज दैट ऑब्जर्व ऑल ऑफ अस हैव अ वराइटी ऑफ थिंग्स दैट पास थ्रू आवर विजुअल हराइजन्स एंड अमॉन्ग द थिंग्स दैट वी सी इफ यू ऑब्जर्व दैम if you carefully uh, see them and contemplate on them we can gain a lot of knowledge in fact most of modern science has progressed by gaining this knowledge by careful observation of the natural world around us at the same time while this knowledge and its advancement are significant understanding what we observe is valuable but even more and invaluable is understanding what it is that observes who is the inner seer who, who what is it inside us that observes that analyzes that learns based on such observations that is something which is not easy to understand and that is where spiritual knowledge is what matters for us spiritual knowledge is what enables us to learn that which is most important that which is of decisive importance for us is learned through uh, inner intro, inner inquiry and you know, we could say that oh actually it's my brain but the brain is just a matter of cells uh, brain cells and none of them are in themselves conscious and no matter how complicated be the brain phenomena uh, we could have a computer performing many of the functions that we function we perform but it would not have any consciousness so what is the need for consciousness and how does consciousness come about that is something which is a complicated question and if you understand that that can lead to a huge leap in our knowledge and that knowledge can be so amazing the bhagavad gita points to this in 229 when it says आश्चर्यवत पश्यति कश्चिदेन आश्चर्यवत वदति थैव चान्य आश्चर्यवच्च इन मन्य शृणोति श्रुत्वाप्येन वेदन चैव कश्चेत इट इज सो अमेजिंग दैट सम पीपल कैन अंडरस्टैंड एंड मेनी पीपल कांट बट इफ यू अंडरस्टैंड इट विल बी अमेज्ड एंड इफ यू डोंट अंडरस्टैंड इट पीपल विल बी अमेज्ड थॉटफुल पीपल हाउ कैन यू लिव विदाउट अंडरस्टैंडिंग योरसेल्फ सो the bhagavad gita opens us to this inner illumination by encouraging us to not only study our observations but study the observer within us and that can be the quantum leap in our knowledge which transforms our life for the positive forever thank you hari krishna